Jazz 88.3 and the New Jazz Sing. That's music from Third Story in their self-titled disc. That's a composition from guitarist Jeff Miles. It's called It's All Around You, and uh, members of Third Story are joining us uh, tonight here on the New Jazz Thing. Um, uh, Joshua White, uh, I haven't had, uh, had a chance to have you in the studio in a while, so congratulations on your Monk Award from Ooh. last year. Oh, thank oh, you very much. Yeah, that was uh, mm -hmm. pretty cool, and all of San Diego is very proud of you. Um, first, um, how did the band's name Third Story uh, come together? Because there's four of you, actually. Uh, or is it just you three that do all the interviews? And so that, <laughs> that's the third story part. Well, I actually think I, I need to pass that to Danny because he was the kind of originator of the, the uh -huh. concept of the third story. But I think it's very apt in what we're trying to accomplish and what we're trying to do right here with this group and this material. Mm -hmm. So, well, um, then let's then let's talk a little bit about uh, about your contributions here. Oh, sure. um, the uh, the uh, the lot has been made of the sound, the uh, ECM recording sound uh, here uh, on this disc, and kind of the way that it uh, that it uh, gets into some of that and brings back some memories of that. Is that music that you're uh, familiar with, Joshua? Absolutely. I mean. You know, I try to, you know, broaden my horizons as far as, like, what I listen to. So I try to listen to a wide range of material, you know. Like, if we're talking about the jazz tradition all the way, you know, from the 10s and uh, 20s all the way up to, like, modern cats who are playing now. And that includes, you know, ECM releases from, like, the 70s and 80s with a lot of, you know, really great artists like Keith Jarrett and, you know, others like that, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Well, um, the recording process that you guys uh, went through when you guys uh, got in the studio, I, uh, this was uh, done over a couple of days, a pretty quick, uh, quick turnaround. Uh, were a lot of these uh, single takes? Um, yeah, I, I mean, that's all we really had time for. I mean, <laughs> we really got to get in there and really focus on what we want to do and what we want to accomplish and what we want to sound like. So you don't have the luxury of trying to say, oh, let's change this, let's change this. It's like we have to have a clear concept of what we want to accomplish when we start recording, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Yeah. And then by doing that, you really capture the energy of the moment and the creativity that's going on with us, you know, as we converse, you know, in this, you know, environment. Mm -hmm. you know? Well, I um, uh, wanted to play some uh, music that featured you and, uh, and you can uh, you can blame Danny if this isn't the one that you wanted to hear because he was here while you guys were running around the parking lot. But um, <laughs> you have, uh, uh, your composition, um, Scarlet Tanager, is uh, is what Danny picked, and we've uh, kind of fast forwarded it to uh, somewhere in the middle where you're uh, you're taking a solo. You want to tell us a little bit about uh, your composition and uh, and your work on this? Actually, the the name that I came up with this, the, the title for this composition was really brought on by a calendar we have in the multimedia room at my church and it features birds of the month, right? And when I came up with this tune, it just happened to be on that bird, you know, the Scarlet Tanager, uh -huh. you know, and I was like, man, that's, that's, a, that's a cool title, you know what I mean? <laughs> and like the, the tune itself is really just, I really wanted to capture a vibe and an energy derived from the repeated figures in the A section and then build to the B section which is like an all-out kind of like almost like a drum feature you know that we you know sit the harmony and melody on top of what the drummer is building off of and then we come back to the repeated figure and the solos are really a chance for the soloist to explore you know and move in different directions and really focused on listening you know what's going on. Excellent. Well, let's check it out. Uh, this is from Third Story, and the tune is Scarlet Tanager from Joshua White. And this is uh, Joshua White solo, if we've got this uh, all uh, <laughs> hooked in correctly. Here on the New Jazz Thing, Jazz 88.3. You never told me it was a bird, Joshua. I'm going to play totally different, man. Hey, Vince, if you want, if you want to ask me any of those questions about like, the name of the band or anything, Okay. Yeah. Uh, I wouldn't expect it. That's all right. It's kind of a, a not so clear of a meaning. That's good. Okay. Good. That makes for a good story. For a third story. Oh. Easy, big guy. Oh. Go easy, Dan. Yeah. Go easy, man. Wow. Take five. Take five. It's cool, man. Way too much. <laughs> it's part of me now. <laughs> I 
Was haben wir getan? Was haben wir getan? Was haben wir getan? featuring the pianist in the band, Joshua White, is his composition called Scarlet Tanager. 